Hey guys, welcome back to Thunderdome Homestead. Just come in from a long day of uh, doing the things. Uh, I am currently redoing the household kitchen. And um, I picked up all the stuff to do that today. Cabinets and uh, drywall. I mean, it's a down to the studs. Uh, so... Uh, yeah, it's it'll be a fun time. Alright guys, Cyber Polygon is the topic today. I don't think most of you have heard of this. If you have, kudos. Um, but if not, here's a little backstory. So, previous... Or prior, I should say, to the um, Kung Flu outbreak. <clears throat> prior to that, there was a there was an exercise by the World Economic Forum and the powers that be that essentially game planned. The exact same thing happening. And then what do you know? A couple months later. Here it is. Hmm. I don't believe in coincidence anymore. And I don't think you should either. So. I've got an article here for you. <clears throat> It is from uh, tweaktown.com. Granted, it is not the most mainstream thing in the world, but it's there. It was like the third result that popped up, so it can't it can't be any sort of slouch. In the world of news. So. <clears throat> Alright, so here we go. Cyber Polygon. Worldwide drill right now. For, quote, cyber pandemic. Now, guys, keep in mind this article was from July 10th, 2021. So, about a year ago. So, let me get into the nitty-gritty of this. Uh, Cyber Polygon 2021 kicked off this year once again. This year, the training drill and event will react to a, quote, cyber pandemic, unquote, and global response to ransomware. With months leading up to the annual Cyber Polygon event, we saw many ransomware attacks in the real world. Large attacks even taking down the U.S. East Coast oil supply, which I experienced that firsthand. Uh, it was mainly in the South. Um, at that particular time, I was traveling... Uh, I went on vacation. I went to New Orleans because I had an alligator gar charter fishing trip, uh, which ended up getting canceled. That sucked. But um, So I went down there, and I made the decision to bring two five-gallon gas cans with me and good thing, too, because I needed them. By the time we needed gas on the way home, there was no gas to be found. That pipeline had been screwed with and shut down, and if I didn't have that 10 gallons of gas with me, we wouldn't have made it home. So, <clears throat> alright, so back to the article. Uh... Cyber Polygon 
2021 will have governments, worldwide authorities, executives from some of the largest companies in the world, and speakers that talk about risks. There... Oh, that's weird. That's a typo. Somebody doesn't know the difference between there, there, and there. <clears throat> Experience on tackling ransomware on a global scale and more. Strategic Digital Risk Management Company, Bizone, and part of, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that, ecosystem, uh, with full support from the World Economic Forum, um, where the last big scale event like this was event 201. Oh, oh wow, here we go. So, um, what I said earlier. Event 201 took place in October of 2019 and simulated a co uh, coronavirus, no, I'm, I'm just going to say it, coronavirus outbreak. Which then happened in the real world weeks later. And now we're living in that current world. Uh, I have to police the way that I word things on YouTube. Or I just won't get any traction on my videos. So that's why I've been skirting around uh, the war that's going on overseas because if you say certain keywords the algorithm will just pretty much block you so all right back to the article <clears throat> uh, last year the world economic forum kicked off the great reset which saw the world economic forum seeing a Quote, unique opportunity to shape the recovery, unquote, from the pandemic. The Great Reset Initiative uh, has, quote, set dimensions to build a new social contract that honors the dignity of every human being, unquote. No, listen, guys. These people are like politicians. They make everything sound good they make everything sound like it's gonna be awesome for you okay look where we are right now they made this bullshit sound fucking fantastic it's not i don't know one person that's happy with the way that things are going right now and if you are you're just fucking dumb so, yeah, there's that. Anyhow, back to the article. World Economic Forum founder Klaus Schwab. If you look at this guy, go, go Google a picture of this guy. Doesn't he make you think of Dr. Evil? Like, from uh, Austin Powers. Like, if you go and look at this dude, straight up. Dr. Evil. Anyhow, Klaus Schwab opened up Cyber Polygon 2021 by saying, A lack of cybersecurity has become a clear and immediate danger to our society worldwide. We have seen in the, pla or, bleh, bleh, in the past few months, for example, ransomware attacks targeting hospitals, critical infrastructure, school systems, the power grid, and many other essential services. He continued, Citizens are feeling the repercussions of cyber attacks directly. Citizens are impact by yeah, impacted by energy shortages. Alright guys, sometimes I get tongue-tied. If you don't like it, hit the road, Jack. Um, delayed medical treatment and other effects this new breed of audacious cyber attacks causes. This is not a problem that is easily solved. Ransomware attacks are complex, and criminal enterprises are increasing their scale and impact. This highlights the need 
for structured multi-stakeholder, multilateral approach to secure our society against them. Yeah. So, guys, they war game this shit ahead of time. They tell you what they're going to do right to your face. When are you going to get it? They literally put this stuff out in front of you like a fish bait on a hook. And you're going to bite it. Because you have no option. You know what? I'm going to give you an option right now. Here's your option. Become self-reliant and independent of all the systems that they can control. Create your own food. Become energy independent on your own household. Because you know what? The country can do whatever it wants. But as long as you have your own shit covered... It doesn't matter what they do. Food. Energy. Water. Find a way to get and create or whatever with your own water. Because that's another thing that they're going to have control of. And pay off your debt. And once, all you, got, and once you got all that stuff figured out. Stock up gold and silver because you got to pay your taxes somehow. And if your dollars are worthless, well, you ain't going to hold on to that chunk of property you got if you don't have something to pay the taxes with. Taxes have existed pretty much forever. They haven't gone away. So unless we enter the walking dead. And everything just goes to hell. You're going to have to pay your taxes. Alright guys. If you got something out of this. Like, share, subscribe. If you want to. If not, I don't really care. Um... The most important thing to me is that you see this and you do something. Take advantage of the knowledge that you're getting now before the masses and everybody else wakes up to the fact. And then it's too late. You know, because uh, it's just the line on, it's, it's like the line at uh, Black Friday. You want to be there before everybody else. Not that I shop at Black Friday. Because I went there once on accident. Uh, I needed spray paint. And I didn't even realize it was Black Friday. I was actually uh, welding a part for a customer. And I needed to paint it. So I went to go pick up some paint. And I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> it's Black Friday. Because everybody and their brother was in the store. So, I digress. Yeah, um, you want to beat the crowd. Now is that time. That time is running short. Do it now. Or don't do it at all. Alright guys, I'll talk to you later.